Hello everyone, welcome to Talented Developer. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to reverse a number in Java. First of all, we need one input. So I can say here int num equal to 1, 2, 3, 4. We have to reverse this num value. That means I can say we need output here 4, 3, 2, 1. So first of all, we need 4, then we need 4, 3, then we need 4, 3, 2, then we need 4, 3, 2, 1. So I'm going to declare one variable that I can say result and it will hold the reverse value, right? So I'm going to use here while loop. I can say here num not equal to 0. So this while loop will be run until this num value will become 0, right? So if you see this output, right? Our first target is we have to get the 4. Right, so how we can get, we can say here int remainder, that means rem equal to num modulus of 10. So currently num value is what? 1, 2, 3, 4. And if you do the modulus of 1, 2, 3, 4, you will get remainder as a 4. So now what? We have remainder as a 4. So you can see here, right? It will look like we got this 4 but actually this is not actual value so i can say here so our formula will be like result equal to result into 10 plus remainder this is the main formula why i am doing let's try so currently result value is what 0 into 10 and remainder is what 4 will get value as a 4 right that means currently result value is 4 so now you can see right we got first value 4 then our target is 3 that means we have to eliminate this 4 so how we can do we can say here num equal to num divided by 10 that means 1 2 3 4 you will get here output as a 1 2 3 right then it will go on the top so currently num value is 1 2 3 yes it is not equal to 0 then it will come here now what num is 1 2 3 modulus of 10 so we'll get here output now 3 correct so now what result we have result here 4 so i can say 4 into 10 correct and remainder value is now 3 4 into 10 that means 40 plus 3 correct so now result is what 43 so again num is what 1 2 3 we have then divided by 10 we'll get here 1 2 because 4 and 3 we got now our target is what 2 1 that's why we are doing divided by 10 so now what num equal to 1 2 again it will go yes 12 is not equal to 0 then 12 modulus of 10 will get here remainder as a 2 then what will be happen currently result equal to what 43 so i can say here 43 into 10 plus remainder is what 2 so we'll get here 430 plus 2 that means 432 right then it will go down now num is what 12 by 10 we'll get here output as a 1 that means num value is 1 again it will go on the top right so here what will be happen num num is 1 modulus of 10 that means will get here remainder as of 1 so when it will go to the this result that means result is what 4 3 2 into 10 plus 1 right so it will become 4 3 2 1 right again it will come down right so what will be happen 1 divided by 10 it will become 0 yes it will not satisfy this condition then it will go out of this while loop and after that right we can just print here this out right this result value right so this result value will be 4 3 2 1 right so let's write the code and we can cross check this logic so we need input here int num equal to 1 2 3 4 so here i'm just taking number as a static value you can use a scanner class and you can take input from the user also and we need one int result variable also it is going to hold the reverse value so we have to use same logic so our logic is what while loop and in this while loop num not 
equal to zero you can see here same logic i'm also going to implement here so first of all we need remainder value so i can say here int remainder equal to num modulus of 10 right after that what we have to get the result value so that means we have to use our formula so what was the formula result equal to result into 10 plus remainder right and once we got the result that means we have to get number value first of all the num will be what 1 2 3 4 then we need 1 2 3 then 1 2 then 1 so we need num equal to num divided by 10 right you can see here num equal to num divided by 10 and after that we need to print here final result and this will print our result value that means the reverse value and here i want to print normally result at each while loop so how we can do just come here copy result right now run this code you can see here first of all result is 4 then 43 then 432 then 4321 4 43 432 4321 now we can cross check with one more way just come here and put the breakpoint run into debug mode so at first time num value is what 1 2 3 4 right so 1 2 3 4 modulus of 10 that means we'll get remainder here 4 value correct now once we cross the line number 11 after that it will print the result result is 4 now num is currently 1 2 3 4 it is going to divide it by 10 so once it will cross this line again it will go this while loop after that you can see num value has been changed as a 1 2 3 because we have divided by 10 you can see right so currently we have 1 2 3 again remainder is 3 because 1 2 3 modulus of 10 that means we'll get remainder here 3 and now result is 4 so 4 into 10 plus 3 it will become 43 you can see here right after that num is what 1 2 1 2 modulus of 10 that means remainder here 2 once you cross this line the result is 4 3 2 right now num is 1 2 that means divided by 10 it will become 1 you can see here 1 1 modulus of 10 that means we'll get remainder as 1 here current result is what 4 3 2 that means 4 3 2 into 10 plus 1 we'll get output here 4 3 2 1 after that what will be happen again it will not go inside this while loop so you can see here num is 0 that's why it does not satisfy this condition after that it came to line number 15 and you can see here we got here final result as a 4 3 2 1 so i hope you understand how to write the logic and on the basis of logic how to write the code please like this video and you can mention your feedback in the comment section thanks